Hello, and today we're doing chicken and dumplings. So it's going to require not a lot of stuff. As you can see, we already started some of the process. So we're going to move around to this. First, you're going first you're going to need a good amount of flour for the dumplings, milk. Now, some people will say get cream, but you probably don't need to get all that. What you really need is condensed soup. Now, don't try and get Campbell's because it's going to be way more. more. And if you really look at it, the labels, it's 10 ounces. This is 10 ounces, just as good. Now, you can add more salt. You can add more whatever that you for the taste and stuff. Even more. Some people put mushrooms or whatever. But the whole thing about it is, is to get the cream. Now, if you want to do the, the harder way, you can get get the actual cream and make it with cornstarch and such. Now, if you've cooked some of those foods with me, with me and stuff, you know that you're, you probably already have still a, a good amount of cornstarch. Now, if you want it thicker, you can add cornstarch to it. What else we're going to use? We're going to use sweet peas. Now, you can also use carrots and corn. I just got two of these sweet peas, and we're, I have two of corn in the back, and we're going to add that a little bit later. But well, right now, we're going to look at the pot right now. I've already started the process, but I'm going to show you a little bit what's going on right now. Now, uh, I have a whole ch chicken in there, and we're going to do just like any process with any chicken soup, which is just a little bit different. We put uh, all the cans inside, and uh, we put salt and pepper. Now, salt and pepper is optional unless you really want to and poultry seasoning. Do not get chicken seasoning because chicken seasoning is for frying chicken. Poultry seasoning is specifically for making soups. The taste that you would get for with uh, those condensed uh, stock or with the bouillons is basically what poultry soup and water, poultry seasoning and water will do for you. So you really don't need all that. It's better to be cheap and make sense. So we have the water, which is going over the top of the, the whole chicken. The poultry with seasoning, if it's a whole chicken, depending on how what you taste, I would say up to half of, half of the poultry seasoning. We have four condensed soups. Now we're going to have it boil a little bit and see what happens. We may add cornstarch to it, but I'm saying that... Uh, uh, and milk, but I'm saying that you probably don't need to. So, but, you know, always have an extra amount if you need to. And uh, we're just gonna gonna cook this out and see what happens. So come back a little bit later. All right, bye.